I'm Simon Strasser, I'm the staff scientist for Space Place here on the fourth floor at Science North. Hi, today we're going to show you guys something really cool. Now you might actually be wondering what this weird contraption beside me here is and why I'm holding a two liter pop bottle in my hands. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to launch a two liter pop bottle and I'm going to show you guys how you can build your own rocket launcher. Okay, so let's talk about what you need to build your bottle rocket. Well, the first thing is a two liter pop bottle. We need a couple other things and actually what you need is a few zip ties right here and also a piece of electrical tubing works really well. You're gonna cut it pretty short and then make two holes through it like this so that we can insert the zip tie through the tubing. And it should look something like that. After we've done that, we're gonna put this piece of tubing around the bottle with a few more zip ties. We put it all together and we have a nice little uh, tube on the side of the bottle. So now we have our rocket. The idea now is that we're gonna pump air into here, create a lot of high pressure, and when we release the bottle, the air is gonna rush out the bottom and shoot up the rocket. Okay, so now we need a way to keep this bottle in place while we pump air into it. So we have our Science North bottle rocket launcher here, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna insert the tube here onto this pipe so that it goes up nice and straight, and it's gonna sit right here where we're gonna be able to pump air in. And then we're going to put these two clamps onto the bottle to keep it in place while we pump, pump it in. Now let's take a closer look at this. So what we have here is we have a piece of rubber with a hole in it uh, where the air is coming through from the hose that's attached to the bike pump. And we can actually use um, a truck tire valve for it. It's really well for that. You can read about that in the write-up. And then we have these two clamps to attach the bottle. So as I showed before, we're going to put it on here. We're going to push that in. Now when we actually launch it, we're gonna have a little bit of water in here as well to create a good seal. And then once we have that, we're gonna push this piece onto our clamp to keep it in place. And we're gonna pull that away and that's when the rocket is gonna shoot up. Here's our bike pump and you'll notice that we have a hose here going into the launcher so we can pump the air into the bottle. Okay kids, so now we're outdoors because you don't wanna launch a rocket indoors. Um, you want to make sure that you're in a safe place to launch rockets. Also, you want to make sure you check with your parents so you're doing it safely. And the first thing you want to do now is we're going to pour some water into this bottle. Now remember that so we can make a nice seal. We're going to put our bottle onto our bottle rocket launcher. We're going to attach it, check that everything is good, and pump some air in. And when we can't pump any harder anymore, we're going to launch the rocket. 